Song Jun Ki's cameo in Queen of Tears is the comic relief we all needed. I've been a wreck over Hayan and Hein Wu's relationship for the past seven episodes, and I've been desperate to feel some happiness after all the crying I've done. K drama fans were gagged when Song Jun Ki also appeared in the drama as the iconic mafia lawyer we've all come to love. For those who don't know, Song Jun Ki played the role of a mafia lawyer, Vincenzo Cassano in the hit K-drama series Vincenzo. But if you think the K-drama references stop there, his prior roles were also mentioned in his other hit dramas, such as Descendants of the Sun, A Werewolf Boy, and Space Sweepers. Unveiling this subtle symphony, exploring the intricate tapestry of K-dramas through Vincenzo's cinematic interplay. In the vast realm of Korean dramas, there exists a mesmerizing symphony of visual storytelling, where every scene unfolds like a carefully choreographed dance, leaving audiences spellbound with its intricate nuances. As a fervent admirer of this art form, I often find myself delving deeper into the labyrinth of narratives, discovering hidden gems that elevate the viewing experience to unparalleled heights. Recently, while immersing myself in the captivating world of K-dramas, a revelation struck me with the force of a thunderbolt. It was during a pivotal moment in the acclaimed series, Vincenzo, that the realization dawned upon me, the power of music as a silent protagonist orchestrating emotions with unparalleled finesse. As the protagonist, portrayed by the talented Song Jung Ki, made his grand entrance, a familiar melody gently caressed the ears of attentive viewers. The haunting strains of Vincenzo's background theme music permeated the scene, seamlessly weaving into the fabric of the narrative like a whispered secret shared among kindred spirits. In that moment, the boundaries between reality and fiction blurred, transcending the confines of the screen to envelop the audience in a symphony of emotions. Perhaps, to the untrained eye, it might seem like a mere coincidence, a serendipitous alignment of sound and sight. However, to those who possess a keen eye for detail, it was a masterstroke of cinematic brilliance, a subtle nod to the interconnectedness of storytelling elements each contributing to the overarching tapestry of the narrative. In the world of K-dramas, every aspect serves a purpose, from the meticulous set design to the evocative soundtrack, each working in harmony to evoke a visceral response from the audience. It's akin to a carefully orchestrated ballet, where every movement is deliberate, every note resonating with profound meaning. This revelation not only deepened my appreciation for the artistry behind K-dramas, but also reaffirmed my belief in the transformative power of storytelling. Through the lens of Vincenzo's cinematic interplay, I was reminded of the profound impact that a well-crafted narrative can have on our lives, transcending cultural barriers to unite us in shared moments of joy, laughter, and even tears. In conclusion, as I reflect on my journey through the captivating world of K-dramas, I am reminded of the words of renowned filmmaker Federico Fellini, who famously said, Cinema is an old whore, like circus and variety, who knows how to give many kinds of pleasure. Indeed, in the case of Vincenzo and its seamless integration of music into the fabric of storytelling, it's not just entertainment, it's pure cinematic magic. A roller coaster of emotions, anticipating the fallout in Episode 9 of Queen of Tears. In the realm of captivating dramas, few series have managed to grip audiences as fiercely as Queen of Tears. With its gripping storyline, compelling characters, and unexpected twists, it has become a staple in the hearts of viewers worldwide. However, with the recent bombshell revelation in Episode 8, fans are left reeling and eagerly anticipating the fallout in the upcoming Episode 9. The latest episode delivered a gut-wrenching blow as the Hongs, the beloved protagonists of the series, were unceremoniously ousted from both their company and their home. It was a shocking turn of events that left viewers on the edge of their seats. Their hearts breaking for the resilient family who had already endured so much. But even amidst the turmoil, there was a glimmer of hope. A subtle nod to another beloved series that sent ripples of excitement through the fandom. As the dust settled on the Hong's devastating predicament, eagle-eyed viewers couldn't help but notice a subtle reference to the popular K-drama. Vincenzo! It was a clever juxtaposition that momentarily lifted spirits, serving as a poignant reminder of the interconnectedness of the cinematic universe. However, the brief respite provided by the Vincenzo reference was short-lived, 
as reality came crashing down once more. Now, with the Hongs facing their most formidable challenge yet, fans are left pondering how they will navigate this treacherous terrain. Will they rise from the ashes like phoenixes, or will they succumb to the weight of their circumstances? As the countdown to episode 9 begins, anticipation is at an all time high. Viewers are bracing themselves for an emotional roller coaster ride, knowing full well that nothing is off limits in the world of Queen of Tears. With each passing moment, the tension mounts, leaving audiences eagerly awaiting the next chapter in this gripping saga. Fortunately, the wait is almost over. Episode 9 of Queen of Tears is set to premiere on Netflix on April 6, 2024, promising to deliver yet another unforgettable installment in this epic tale of love, loss, and redemption. So mark your calendars, stock up on tissues, and prepare to be swept away by the emotional tsunami that awaits. The Hongs may have been knocked down. But one thing's for certain, they're not out of the game just yet, navigating the twists and turns, reflecting on the latest episode of Queen of Tears. In the tumultuous world of Queen of Tears, every twist and turn leaves viewers gasping for breath, eagerly awaiting the next chapter in the saga of the embattled Hong family. The latest episode was no exception, delivering a gut-wrenching blow as long-standing adversaries Mo Sulhi and Yoon Yunsung launched their most audacious attack yet, threatening to strip the Hongs of everything they hold dear. From the very outset, it was clear that Mo Sulhi and Yoon Yunsung had been plotting their revenge meticulously, biding their time until the opportune moment presented itself. Their calculated move to take everything from the Hong sent shockwaves through the storyline leaving viewers reeling from the sheer audacity of their actions. Amidst the chaos, however, there was a glimmer of hope, a beacon of light amidst the darkness. Hian Wu, despite the tumultuous nature of his relationship with Heian, emerged as a steadfast ally, proving his reliability and unwavering commitment to what's best for his former spouse. As the storm clouds gathered overhead, there was a palpable sense that their shared adversity might just be the catalyst for healing old wounds and rebuilding fractured relationships. Indeed, as the Hongs faced their inevitable downfall, there was a flicker of optimism that amidst the rubble, the seeds of redemption might be sown. Perhaps, in the crucible of adversity, the true nature of familial bonds would be revealed, paving the way for reconciliation and forgiveness. Yet, even amidst this glimmer of hope, it was undeniably difficult to witness the unraveling of the Hong's once idyllic existence. The relentless onslaught of misfortune seemed unrelenting, leaving viewers grappling with a sense of despair as they bore witness to the family's inexorable decline. As the series hurtles towards its conclusion, one thing remains abundantly clear. Queen of Tears is not for the faint of heart. With each passing episode, the emotional stakes are raised higher, leaving audiences on tenterhooks as they anxiously await the resolution of the Hong's tumultuous journey. While it may be tempting to dwell on the sorrow and hardship that pervades the narrative, there is wisdom in looking towards the future with optimism. For amidst the tears and turmoil, there lies the possibility of redemption, of a new beginning born from the ashes of the old. So, as we brace ourselves for the trials and tribulations that lie ahead, let us hold fast to the hope that a happy ending awaits. For in the world of Queen of Tears, anything is possible. Even amidst the darkest of storms, the sun will eventually break through the clouds.